holiday season. Uh, we'll grab some more Final Fantasy 16. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and keep it going. Uh, or, yeah, head back with the main mission. Uh, we did a few quests last video, and we did uh, what's it called? Uh, what's going on with the main mission? We went back through the town, and they were all slaughtered and stuff like that, which is pretty crazy. But um, yeah, let's keep it going. Pretty sure I'll probably get on these videos. Uh, like, I'm just gonna hit the notification bell so you see when I post. And uh, yeah, let's get it. So what God's forsaken corner of the realm is Sid dragging you off to this time? Oriflam. The holy capital. And what business would you lot having? On second thoughts, I don't want to know. Um, I'm already good on weapons. I don't need nothing. But the, the weapons I actually got from her last time, I'm still good. This is reduce seat wave cooldown time. Yeah, and I really don't need any of this yet. Not that I, not that I know of. I mean, I've been doing fine. Especially feels number break days. Thirty seconds. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm okay. Speaking of Oriflam, I hear the trading routes leading south have seen more than double the usual traffic. If you ask me, some at Fowl's Brewing, and it ain't tires bore by tea. Oh, just go and see Otto, will ya? All right. I heard Otto barking at his lot earlier. Take a seat, Clive. I'll fetch you a bowl of brown. We should do. So you're really going through with it? Sid's been talking about bringing down a mother crystal since I've known him. But that's all it's ever been. Talk. He's convinced it's the right thing to do. We'll be leaving for the capital shortly. <sighs> well, you couldn't have picked a better moment. Seems the eye in the Royalists gave him wasn't enough to dampen old Sylvester's spirits. His legions are on the march again. This time, due south. Another war. All as the great Grieger wills it. Bloodthirsty little miss, that one. Well, that's gods for you, innit? Still, might work to our advantage on this occasion. Wars breed chaos. On the front lines, and at home. With a fair wind behind them, a handful of like-minded ne'er-do-wells could melt into the back alleys of Oriflam. No trouble. Is making it to the capital that's the problem. The checkpoint. That's right. Anyone traveling in or out of Oriflam has to go through Northreach. Lucky for you, I might just know of a way. There's. Well, no, not that. That gets you an audience with the Dame. And it's the Dame who'll see you safely through Northreach. I'll send the Stolas in the morning. Let her know you're coming. We go way back. And she's a true friend of the cause. I'm sure you'll get on like a house on fire. That's mm. good of you, but... Who is this dame, and where will I find her? She's the proud proprietress of Northreach's foremost house of ill repute. The Vale. And she's quite a woman, if you know what I mean. A woman. Right. <laughs> Don't go blind, you know, with your charm now, lad. I'll be expecting a full report when you get back. Take a trip. Uh oh, what's going on here? Oh, is that the, uh... Wait, what? Alien reports unlocked. Um, let see, now available for viewing by speaking to... Oot, that was the name. Um, I don't know. kind of names. Yes, that was reports. Contains information on quests currently available across Valista. 
Okay. I suppose that's everything. Now to find Gav. Just talk to him real quick. Oh, you're the new lad, aren't you? Goat at your service. Goat. Well, at the hideaway service, anyway. Otto's put me in charge of reading through the reports sent in by our allies and picking out any problems that might warrant the attention of the curse breakers. Or any other willing volunteers. And there's no shortage of problems, I can tell you. <laughs> or maybe I don't have to. I'll warrant a strapping lad like you who's got people begging him for help wherever you go. Anyway, if you're ever interested in taking a look over the list, just say the word. Reckon you could probably tick off the odd thing here and there. They say little acts of kindness are their own reward. But if that ain't enough, these have got proper bounties on them and all. Yeah, take, a, take a look at it real quick. Uh, but also travel immediately to the others. Okay. Welcome to committee. Oh, you can. Oh. Okay, this is a different area. Ah, but I, I, I don't want to travel to it right now. So I'll do this another time. Seen enough? But it's pretty good. And I just gotta remember that. Well, 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 someone's in a hurry. Just following orders. Funny, I never took you for the type. Can't all be as obedient as you, Gav. Yeah? <laughs> Fine day for a little mischief, wouldn't you say? Is this all of us? Actually, Gav won't be coming. Just the three of us, then? Drake said is the keystone of the Empire. Oriflam's in chaos, yes, but that doesn't mean we can march an army through her gates. The fewer our numbers, the better our chances of going unnoticed. And should that plan fail, well, we have our icons to fall back on. Sid, I... I don't know if I can. Ifrit still seems to... come and go as he pleases. Ordinarily, primary an icon comes naturally to a dominance. But then, you are no ordinary dominance. Well, he's still got the blessing of the Phoenix, doesn't he? Not to mention what he sucked out of Garuda. And did I ever tell you about how he was once the greatest shield in Rosaria? You know, I reckon he could probably cause a path out of the capital on his own if need be. Let's try not to find out. We're less likely to be spotted if we travel separately. I'll meet you in Northridge in a few days. You two behave now. So, we're it's meeting right. in Northridge. And will I find Sid and Jill before this dame finds me? Is that, uh, what's his face right here? Oh, somebody is. Let me check something out. Uh, I do want to see if I can... I got 1,200. Nah, I still can't get these yet. I'm gonna keep grinding. Um... Probably need to upgrade that, but I'm gonna do that later. Don't use that often. Mm, probably need to upgrade that. Um, Lord map. Okay, where are we going? Where are we going? 
We're going all the way over here. Okay. Still got a way to go. A lot closer. I didn't deceive him. Want it. There, boy. Sick of toggle. It's over. Bro. Come here. Wait, try to fight y'all. But it's like sales. Is the girl? Is she not with us? Oh. Hey, I think these are friendly. There. There we go. North Ring. The soldiers used to speak of a brothel, but that was north of the checkpoint. friends in the south here we go a moment my lady a moment <laughs> I doubt you could afford even that much of my time branded my mistake no, mine. Upon reflection, you don't have the scent of a branded about you. The flowers. Otto always did know how to please me. More than Sid ever did anyway. Do you think you could please me, Clive? You're the dame. Let us leave such. Impersonal titles to my less preferred clientele. You can call me Isabel. Otto assured me I could trust you. I can trust you, can't I? You can trust me, yes, but... Why would you... Help you? Because that's what we do. Long ago, Sid did me a kindness when no one else would. I have never forgotten that. Without it, I would not be where I am today. And so, I make it a point to do the same whenever possible. Which brings us here. To the final obstacle between you and whatever it is you seek in the holy capital. I fear the guards are not likely to let a masterless bearer pass unmolested. Unless... Unless... <laughs> Unless, of course, his master deigned to appear. Yes. That will do nicely. But... I shall expect a favor in return. Wait, what? Alright. See what you got. Do you see anything you like? Before the storm, uh, that's a new song. That's it. It's awesome. Come back again. What the hell are you doing? Tut tut. 
We cannot have people thinking I tolerate disobedience from my branded. The men who gave me this are no more my masters than you are. But... It's not as if I can hide it. From the moment you acquired it, that brand has done naught but take. But today, it is going to give you exactly what you want. Just play along. Madame, back to the vial already? But of course, we must make ready to welcome you, my dear. And who might this be? Why, my new escort. The streets aren't safe for a girl, what with all the royalists about. <laughs> well, don't work him too hard. Well, that rather depends on you now, doesn't it? I'll see you all at sunset. Oi, hold up. <sighs> Another fucking branded. Well, you're lucky you're with the dame. Get out of my sight, filth! That wasn't so bad. Wasn't so bad. They might have recognized me. But they didn't. And even if they had, they wouldn't have done anything about it. The gentlemen of the garrison are some of my best customers. We have an arrangement, as do you and I. Now, if you'd care to follow me, we can speak more at the Vale. Doesn't seem like I have much of a choice. I'm, I'm a little confused about all the... Uh different, um, I guess, kingdoms around here, because there is a lot of them, or at least uh, maybe like five, I think. And if anyone requests her company, tell them she is feeling unwell. Madame, you look stunning. As do you, my dear. Shall I have one of the girls draw a bath? That won't be necessary. Clive, my darling, welcome to the Vale. Mm-hmm. I wonder, this must be a waypoint for me now on? Oh, let me check my map. Yeah, this whole area. Huh. More stuff. Oh, the map's gonna be opening up a lot more. Okay. Thank you for seeing me through the gates, my lady. I am in your debt. Well, that was the whole point, wasn't it? And I told you, it's Isabel. Whatever wound you so tight, I wonder. It's certainly not Sid's influence. You, uh, mentioned a favor. What is it you'd have me do? I don't want to keep my companions waiting. If you mean Sid and the girl, you needn't worry. They have yet to reach the checkpoint. Yes, Otto asked me to help them as well. But to answer your question, I need you to find someone for me. One of my girls. Tatienne has been gone for several days now, having left no word of explanation. And I've begun to fear the worst. I feel as if I've spent my whole life searching for people. Though I can't say I'm any good at it. I trust you'll do your best. Oh, and take this. Proof of that trust. And hopefully enough to keep prying eyes from looking too closely at that handsome face of yours. Now, I have matters to attend to at the Iron Flagon. If you find anything, ask for me there. I should probably start here. Can I go here? Okay. 
Got a few quests in here as well. You wear the dame's brooch. She must trust you. Enough to help me look for one of your colleagues. A woman by the name of Tatien. She's still missing then? Oh, if only I'd comforted her. You saw her before she disappeared? The day before. She was in tears. She'd lost her comb, a gift from the dame. It wasn't anything fancy, but you could tell it meant the world to her. You see, Tatien was an orphan, and she looked upon the dame as a mother, as do we all. So she was upset. And I didn't lend her my shoulder. But perhaps someone else did. Tatien shared a room. Her chambermate may have seen something. She's over there, sitting by the pond. Thank you. Let's see what her chambermate can tell us then. So you're the new escort the girls have been talking about. And you've already been sent off on an errand, eh? Poor boy. You'll be knackered before the real work begins later on tonight. I'm told you share a bedchamber with Tatien. Did she say anything to you before? Before she went missing. Only that she needed to meet with someone. She did mention a name, but I know exactly who she meant. You do? Lad from the garrison. Annoying little shit. Spent every gill he earned on Tatien and picked fights with anyone else who tried to buy her time. Followed her around like a lost puppy. Tatien was flattered at first, but it didn't take long for her to get scared. She thought about saying something. But the dame was so proud of her for how much she was bringing in, and she didn't want to let her down. This man from the garrison. Did you ever see him? Of course I did. He tried to sneak into our room enough times. Slimy sod's got a scar over one eye. Claims he got it in battle. You've been very helpful. Don't let him get away with this. Find him, and you'll find her. A man from the garrison. Seems a trip to the barracks is in order. Yeah. Well then, I suppose we'll need to... I'm gonna start fighting. Good. The bones fell favorably. I'm looking for a man with a scar over his eye. Looking for a man? Does this look like a brothel, Branded? Fuck off. Hold your tongue. He wears the dame's brooch. One word from him and the veil's doors will be barred to us for good. <sighs> There's only one man in the garrison with a dodgy eye. His name's Yannick. I haven't seen him around lately, though. On account of him being in war. Yeah, Yannick left a few days back. Said he had dealings with a merchant there. The dame, thanks you. Moore is the last village on the road to Oriflam. I should let Isabel know where I'm headed. E oh, we go. Tell me you bear good tidings. That remains to be seen. Oh, Tatian, you could have told me. This Yannick. The soldiers I spoke to believe he's in the village of Moor. According to them, he claimed to have some business with a merchant there. Though that wouldn't explain his continued absence. And you plan on traveling to Moor to ascertain the truth? Isn't that what you want? Oh, it, it is, but I fear sending you there may cause more harm than good. The people of Moor are rather set in their ways. You'll find they have little love for bearers, and they will not hesitate to report one such as you to the constabulary. There is a sure? man in Moor who owes me a favor, more than one, in fact. His name is Bertrand, and he works at the stables. Tell him I sent you. I shall return as soon as I find something. Alright, let me check this out. Yeah, it's pretty far. So it's here. Oh, it's up. Oh, okay. I just gotta run. 
purchase the day, don't they? Go up this way. Think I might see you tonight. Oh, this that uh okay. I was wondering where we are, so that's right next to that place where we saw those people at for the king. Oh no. Yeah, we're um oh, the king's palace. Oh, we got another one over there. Oriflam, how many bearers suffer to keep your granaries full? Got a wide open area. What is that? Oh nothing. I'm not sure what those are. That's enough for today, branded. <laughs> A lot of enemies I can fight, but. Let's head to the main you. mission. Up, the law are you. If the people of Moor are as intolerant as Isabel says, it's no wonder the Empire never sent my unit here. Weren't expecting any new branded until the new moon. You don't think he's a deserter, do you? Is this a place right here? Hold up. Oh, it's over there. Oh, if even a grain is missing, the collectors are my own. Are you Bertrand? The dame sent me. Sounds about right. Only time I hear from her is when she wants something. Well, go on then. What is it? One of her courtesans has gone missing, and I need to find her. A soldier who may have information on her whereabouts is rumored to have come here to meet with a trader. Many traders stopped to peddle their wares on their way to the capital, but only one's been seen quarreling with a soldier. Is he still here? The trader? Oh, yeah. Stubborn sod stood his ground till the soldier got tired of shouting, from what I hear. If you seek him out, keep your head down. Fact is, folks round here would sooner hang a branded than help him. And that's even with the dame's brooch for protection. Understood. Who the fight now? I think I wonder if I talk to the merchant, it'd be an asshole. Buy, sell, or be gone. Ah, he is. Interesting. Good readings. What's this? A branded? Where's your master? Must I call for the constable? I come to you from Northreach, at the behest of the dame. Perhaps you've heard of her. <laughs> Why, of course I have. I am the good lady's servant. Oh, oh, what is it that she requires of me? Rumor has it you were seen arguing with a soldier some few days ago. A soldier with a scar over his eye. Uh, yes, uh, yes, that's right. Uh, he had a comb which he <laughs> claimed was an antique. Said he wanted to trade it for a newer one. But although it was an antique, it most certainly was not, as I told him. Nevertheless, he insisted that it was of great value and was quite vehement about my appraisal. I stood firm, however, and for all his bluster, he still purchased a new comb, albeit an inexpensive one. And do you know where he went after that? 
My customers aren't usually in the habit of telling me whither they are bound. But as it happens, this one did. Yonder ruins, strange as it may sound. My thanks. Not at all. I would do anything for the day. Anything. Uh, be sure and tell her, won't you, that I was helpful, I mean. Most helpful. Around here? Let me, uh... Oh, can't fast travel. Gotta run. Let's go a little off-roading. Got something up there. Hold up. Oh, yeah, there's something over here. So I'm gonna make my way over here. That's where that, uh... Yeah, the gate to that castle's over there. Set Brothers in the Cave. Oh, I'm going towards the gate. What up? That's why we had a little cutscene. Because it looks like we're about to... It smells of death here, Togo. Head this way. Oh, don't tell me they killed her. Or maybe the soldier got killed. Wolves. Oh, that looks like a woman. We can't let them get any closer to the village. Oh, man. You know what to do. Yeah, there's people on the ground. I'm seeing this correctly, they uh, it looks like they got eaten or eaten by yeah, they were mauled. Damn it all. Bodies. A man and a woman. Well the wolves have been busy. But the blood is long dry. So it is you, Tatian. If that's true, then the body next to hers will be Yannick's. The girl Yannick went off to sea every night. He said her name was Tatian. You. Did you follow me? Now, why would I do that? Unless you think I'd have good reason to. But no. I was sent to find Yannick. And by the looks of things, I have. We both found who we were searching for. Nah, he was a jealous sod. Couldn't stand the thought of his woman with someone else. Then one day he sees her with a new comb. Thinks she's got herself a new gallant. Tells the garrison he's gonna find the man and kill him. We know it's all talk, but then he disappears off to more for some dealings and doesn't come back. If you mean this comb, it was a gift from the dame. If only Yannick had bothered to ask, eh? He might not be rotting on a hill. I think he meant to ask her something else. He stole the old comb and bought her a new one in the hope they'd wed. Wed? Where would they have gone? Certainly not back to Northreach with a dame waiting. 
And we all know what happens to deserters. Tell the dame I'm sorry for her loss. When the lads come to collect Yannick's body, I'll see that Tatian is delivered to the Vale. Is that wise? Ah, oh, there won't be any covering up this mess. The most we can hope for is that the dame doesn't hold it against us. Speaking of which, I saw her in Moor just now. Could you tell her what happened? Might sound better coming from you. I need to tell this about. Yes, it's. Perhaps the comb will give her something to remember Tatien by. Can I go this way? Yeah. If it was a message that needed delivering, I could have seen to it, my lady. Of course you could, had it not been personal. You are still in one piece, I see. You will be pleased to hear that your companions have arrived. They said they would meet you at a little chapel to the east of here. Thank you, but... You needn't have come all this way just to tell me. I was on my way to see you. You... you found her then? I see. My dear Tatia. It is by no means uncommon for a client to fall for a courtesan. Especially a client who's young and far from home. But rarely do such tales have happy endings. I found this with Tatien. I believe it was yours. Thank you for returning it. I shall see that it has a place on her pyre. Okay, yeah, it, it does suck, but you know, it happens. You know, it's crazy. A lot of people. Before you do, I have one last gift a token of my thanks. The veil. Counts among its patrons several high ranking officers of the Imperial Army. According to one of the looser tongued gentlemen, it would appear that the legions are planning to march south. Or to mention the same thing. Ah. But did he mention that it was all of the legions? This is no mere skirmish. Were I to guess, I'd say the Emperor planned to abandon the capital. But that couldn't possibly be true now, could it? Take care, Clive. I will. And thank you again. All right, so... Oh, where does that go to? Hold on, let me check this out. Oh. Uh, oh, I think that's that path right there. Okay. Um... Ooh, get a lot of side missions. Can do it later. Got that stuff. Um. Yeah. But I'm gonna go ahead and end this video right here. Um. Oh, wait a minute. Gotta pet the buddy. After it. That's what I'm talking about. Um. One more time. <laughs> There we go. Alright, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video right here. Um, appreciate all the support you get on these. Uh, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you see when I post it. And next time I come back, and we'll keep it going. Keep it moving. Right. See you on the next one.